What's up guys, today we are going to Max Wood Grilled, which we've heard has some of the best pub burgers in the city. We're gonna try a couple of Big Mac ripoffs and see how they taste. And it's that time of the year again where we update the Patreon tiers. Here at Number Six with Cheese, we got a fresh one for you. So for the $10 tier, you're still gonna get early videos. We edit them beforehand, we put them on Patreon, you get them, and you get your name in the description of all the videos. For $15, you're gonna get a 15% off code to all of our merch to use as much as you want. And for 25 bucks, the Big Daddy tier, you're gonna get access to all of our old shirts, like that one. Or this and one. this one and whatever else we put on there which is all of them so you'll get access to that you can buy them as many as you want for the amount of time that you are a $25 patreon member so that's all a bunch of words at you let's go get throw burgers at you <sighs> <laughs> Oh, okay, perfect. Awesome, thank you. Two burgers, two Big Mac knockoffs from Max Wood Grilled Acquired Jump Cut. Thank you. Mm -hmm. It's a heavy ass bag. Right. I assume there's, assume there's a lot of fries in here. Yeah, I'd imagine. I definitely know it came with some. Big boy, Jesus, oh, Pete's. So good, good looking fries too. Well, first one was all right. They look like my type. A little soggy, but yeah. they're like McDonald's-y. Yeah, that's my favorite. All right, Sixers on the dashboard. Take it away for the Corey Wagner second angle. All right, let's take a look. Here, wow, that thing's that thing's a beast, dude. Um, okay, so what do we got? Um, trying to take it apart a little bit for you guys. This is two wood-grilled USDA prime certified Angus beef burgers, eight ounces each, house-made secret sauce, shredded lettuce, it just says American, I'm assuming American cheese, garlic dill pickles, diced white onions, double-decker brioche bun, served with fries. This is a monster burger. Thing's big, dude. She like it the way it dictates. Yeah, I mean, this is a fat-ass burger. Yeah, it is. It looks almost looks like a burger on top of another burger, more than the Big Mac does to me. Big time. <laughs> and then real quick on the big camera, because we got it, there it is for you guys. This platter of food, which is basically a Big Mac and fries, 18 US dollars. It's expensive, but we got a lot of food. Big old burger. When she handed me that bag, I was like, this is a body. Yeah. She was like, what? All right, here we go. The Daddy Max burger, 36 bucks for all this food. Cheers. Cheers. Fat burger. Okay, that's a pretty good flavor. Very good flavor. This to me is like, Exactly the type of burgers that were popular when we were growing up. Yeah, it does have that wood kind of char. It has like almost like a little bit of that. You know, you can like taste it in the meat. Yeah, look at this part burnt. Oh, yeah. <laughs> well, kind of 180 from like they burnt mine for sure. I was. Oh, gross. that's a bummer. I hate burnt. No, oh, yeah, that's not anything. <laughs> that's not weird. It's like big for the sake of being big. It's like not even manageable to yeah, eat. Yeah, it's that. too big. It's a bummer they burnt your bu burger. And I can tell you another drawback, like I told you from looking at it. Yeah. I was hoping to, it didn't have a huge impact, but it's something I noticed. Mm -hmm. You can't tell me these are hand foreign buns. No, they're, they gotta be frozen patties. Frozen patties, like bro. It seems like it. Whoever's telling us, oh, this is a great burger and you're using frozen frickin' patties. Mm -hmm. I mean, granted, you can take a good sauce and like make, that's all it is. This has just got a really good sauce it and does. then they melt it does. the cheese on it. Yes, the sauce is really good. But like, you're not gonna be top of the city. No. This is just such a sports bar burger to me, like in a suburb. Mm -hmm. Like this to me doesn't scream Chicago's culture. We've been talking about this a lot. Chicago is an underrated burger city. Absolutely. You guys obviously know some of the spots that always get talked about, but I think top to bottom, this bur this city is a burger city. And this to me is like, if Applebee's actually did a burger correctly. Yeah, this would be the king of burgers in a local hometown. Absolutely, like this would be called like the monstrosity of Redford. Yeah, and everyone would talk about it and yep. all the, you know, mm -hmm. everyone would get drunk and eat it, but it's average when you're in Burger City. This is, I know. I mean, it's not bad, it's just. No, it's frozen, not bad. Frozen patties, it's big just for the sake of being big. Not tonight, sweetheart, give me that head. Saw so many 
reviews online saying this is the best, one of the best burgers in the city. And it's two guys that have eaten a lot of them. A lot of these burger lists coming out now, there's only maybe one or two we haven't done. Yeah. Fries are soggy too. These fries. Yeah, I generally like these style fries, but they're not flavored either. Ticking time bomb too. You gotta eat these like as soon as they're out of the fryer. Yeah, they do get soggy quick. For some reason with these shoestring or McDonald's style, mm -hmm. I don't necessarily mind the sog as much as long as they're got a little bit of salt on them. These are better than McDonald's fries when they get cold. Like to me, oh, yeah, there's still, still a little bit of value to these. Yeah, McDonald's goes downhill so fast. So fast. Yeah, this is just like, <laughs> this is, I, <laughs> it's just such a place. It's great for the fact that it's like a sports bar in West Town, get beers, watch games there, I get that. But this is exactly the type of burger I think they would bring out to me. Yeah. And 18 bucks, that's reminding me of Blue Door Kitchen. that also used frozen patties, passed it off as fresh, and it was $18. I can tell almost by looking at the buns that it's like the Kroger 10 for 10. Those like just ice pack buns. They're not buns, the, bur the burger meat. It's like that crappy little, or at least it looks like it. It doesn't look like someone made these patties. Like even you can tell by those lines and stuff. Yeah. These guys gotta be making a killing on this. It has to. $18 for two frozen patties? Yeah, Come on. And, and buns are so cheap. And buns are cheap. Lettuce man. is cheap. You can make a house sauce and do it in a big batch. Dude, I from a business perspective, okay. Yeah, good on you. Good you on you. Well. I will say I do like the sauce, but. The sauce is really good. Other than that. That's a big ass burger. Mm-hmm. It will fill you up. Yeah. But I think you can find a, a better use to your $18 if you ask me. Absolutely. I think my last bite had burnt me. Did it? Yeah. Yours that, looks a little better shaped than mine. It I did. Have. Mine did. The last part of it wasn't so much wood grilled as it was wood burnt. Yeah, like, look at this. Like, look how burnt that is. You see that? That's burnt. That's so burnt. I uh, burnt. And I asked it for uh, medium. So This like, is how else you know this is frozen. I know this oh, is frozen. Oh, yeah. How it so comes broke. apart, it's like in, it's almost like a tofu patty. It like doesn't snap like a fresh beef. It's, it's like side. clumped. This they side. only grill. <laughs> like why is your the side that one part's been on the ground? <laughs> like that looks nasty. They dude. never flipped it. This is like yeah, that is so frozen. They like flipped it for a second. We're like, nah, that's that face is the middle. They're never gonna see it. I bet they're not two guy two schmucks out there in their car with a camera. Yeah, what are they gonna pick it apart and look at the middle of it? <laughs> you don't even have to <laughs> cook that. Meet your worst nightmare. <laughs> yeah. We never go into place hoping for that. Like I was so excited to find a burger that like I hadn't really heard of that. Place. I know, right? And I was like, oh, I heard of Max wood grill, I was like, they're fired. I was like, oh, maybe it's like way down division. And I was like, oh, it's in West Town? Yeah. And I've driven by this place a million times, seen the Three Floyds neon for the beers, like went right next to the Boyle Seafood, which I've also never been into. But yeah, that place just kind of escapes my eye. Yeah, dude. There's other better food spots in this area. Don't get don't get that burger. All right, let's turn the frowns upside down <laughs> and give some shout outs to the people that super thanks on this show. We do this Monday to Friday. We've been doing it for six years. So many of you rock with us and financially support the show. And for that, buying the $18 burgers, <laughs> click the dollar sign amount on the YouTube. You'll be able to super thanks like these people like Jim McFarland, Jim McFarland, Sam Bliss. Oh, you see what's next to Sam Bliss's name? Ooh, he's a member. Yeah, that's He's a, got that's the little a, star that's icon. A channel member. Join the $10 monthly. Oh, dude, Sam, thank and you're super thanksing. That's amazing. Derek Boudreaux, Jim McFarland, Derek Boudreaux, David F. C., Scorpion Heat Seeker, Jim McFarland, Derek Boudreaux, Derek Boudreaux. There's the door, Jim McFarland, bring it. Pepper in it. Pepper Hold on, pepper. Sam Bliss coming in with a 20 banger on there, dude. Oh, I'll take that. I'll take it all day. Crazy, dude. That'll get you one frozen double burger in West Town. You better believe it. Mm -hmm. So ridiculous. Dumb. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's unfortunate to say. <laughs> yeah. Do you want to do a look see or scare? Yeah, let me let me just go ahead and <laughs> guy steals the pen. <laughs> ah. What an ass! Oh, we forgot to put Sixer sauce on it. I don't want to put that on a frozen burger. Yeah, it's a I'm good not point. gonna disrespect. Ooh, piece of candy. Don't even let's see that. Um. Yeah. Really nothing. What about oh? I see it. Oh, how did it get in there? Ow! Can you get it? It's tough to get. Oh, f off. Yeah, there you go. Sick. Good eye. Eagle yeah, eyes. that's weird. I never would have thought that it would. That's the third thing I've seen you see, like with like your eagle eyes. I've seen you find money. <laughs> yeah. I've seen you find drugs. drugs. <laughs> yeah. And I've yeah. seen you find this marker. <laughs> all of which you took. Yeah. Yeah. And all those you can use for drugs. You can buy drugs with money, you can sniff that. Oh. <laughs> and then you can also obviously do the other drugs. I like thought you were gonna wood. say, use this to rate food, to make money, to buy oh, yeah. drugs. More of a huffing situation. Yeah, get high on markers. <laughs> we do not endorse that YouTube. What do you mean? If you don't, say I don't. 
I don't. I have no. That. I don't Good have point. a strong. Honestly, I don't have a strong stance well, against people huffing markers. For YouTube and this channel, this channel doesn't endorse that. That's not fair because we we both strike, have one strike. board. We just we, have, well, we both have a board seat. If you'd like to vote, go ahead. Uh, All right. I just want us to make money and not get struck. <laughs> I'm just trying to make people laugh. I don't care about making money. No, that's not true. I really okay. I don't endorse that. Okay, before we go ahead and rate uh, that burger out of five here today, let's break it down one last time and then uh, we'll reveal our scores. Corey, you're up. Yeah, the frozen patty, bummer. It was big just to be big. I like you, the Big Mac, but the Big Mac's edible. I think it's like really fun if they make that like a reasonable size. It was smash burgers. It's also frozen, but because the beef patties are like not so aggressive, you don't get so much of that. Yeah, yeah, you don't get so much of it. I do like the sauce. I'll give them props on the sauce. Yeah. Really, if that was a reasonably priced uh, burger, I think I'd give them a decent score, but the $18 for that, it's a little rough. It's a little rough. I'm not going to kill them on it, but, you know. It felt like they just put a frozen Walmart patty, two of them, on a wood-fired grill. Yeah. Like, you can also do that with Walmart patties, but they're still Walmart patties. And you know what they got at Walmart now? 80-20s and frozen. And you know what they're not? They don't cost? $18. <laughs> $18, yeah. <laughs> Um, I just was overall bummed. Like the sauce was the saving grace of that. That'll get them a little bit of a bump because I wanted to dip my fries in that. I want to. I would yeah. say get a sidecar of that yeah, for the fries. Um, but overall, whenever we have frozen burgers on this channel, because Chicago is a food mecca, you can't do that. Can't do it. Andy, they burn it. I had and that. they burned it. And it was the part hanging off that I had to eat. I had to like pre-eat it, you know? Yeah, the pre-eat. So I, I had a pre-bite, which gave me nothing else to balance out the burn. It was straight burn. Yeah. Water, so, but Sorry, all right, guys. Well, all right, here we go. Alex Trebek, bump that track, and we'll rate it out of five. Okay. We know he's dead. He's in our hearts forever. Let's see. I'm gonna go. Okay, I feel pretty. I feel pretty good about this. I'm not giving. Him, I'm not torturing him on this. I don't know what to do. Because it still wasn't the worst flavor I've had. It just was like. No, you're right. Eighteen dollars. The price hurts it a lot, and the frozen patties. Yeah. Which is two big parts of a burger. <laughs> the price is <laughs> neat. <laughs> All right, cut it off. Cut it off. All right, Corey, on the count of three, reveal your score here today. All right. One. Two, three. Boom. Bang. Whoa. Oh, two, two. Ooh. I went two, six, five. We're seeing it in reverse yeah. on that screen, so yeah. we thought we had the same. Um, yeah, yours is probably closer to correct than mine. I'm surprised you went over halfway. You know, I should have done it with it being 18. Yeah. But I did on accident. I know of the two of us, I'm definitely the one that's a little more like hyper aware of price. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I just waited for you to be like, what? <laughs> Super fun day, other than the fact that the burger wasn't super fun, but uh, we appreciate you guys being here. We'll see you tomorrow for a brand new episode on this show. Number six with cheese, subscribe if you can. Oh, okay. happy Valentine's Day week, too. Yeah, man. As a matter of fact, happy Valentine's Day. I love you, man. I love you, too, buddy. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we'll see you guys soon. We're going to go fuck.